Hi, my name is Luke, and for this Grover, we are going to be learning how to do Scholar's Mate as well as how to defend against it in chess. Scholar's Mate is a quick way to get checkmated to checkmate an opponent who is unsuspecting of what you are going to do. When doing it, the only way it is possible, or the easiest way is possible, is if the kingside pawn is brought up first. After the king pawn is brought up, the opponent will normally respond with this. If this is done, the queen and bishop's goal is to attack this pawn next to the queen king. You can either move your bishop here next, or move your queen to either of these positions. If your bishop is moved to here, the opponent may do other things, anything like this to try and open up their bishop, and the next goal would be to get your queen to attack this piece. When this is done, the opponent may respond in some such manner like this, and the next thing to be done would be the checkmate. You would be able to capture this pawn with your queen, and there is nothing your opponent would be able to do about it. Or is there? The more important part about learning Scholar's Mate, or otherwise known as four move checkmate, because it took four moves to accomplish, is how to defend against it. To defend against four move checkmate, there is one simple move that must be done. When this opening has occurred, and possibly if a queen or bishop has been brought out, all that needs to be done, no matter where the queen is, is to bring your knight to that position. When your knight is brought, to the square in front of the rook, the queen can no longer take this piece freely, and you may even get yourself a free piece of a queen. This is what the board may look like from your side of the board, and the simple thing to do is to bring this knight to right here. If that piece is there, you are safe from fool's mate, or scholar's mate, or four move checkmate, whatever you might call it. That is how you defend as well as do scholar's mate, fool's mate, or four move checkmate. Thanks for watching.